Amir Mohamed, IFL TV, MTK Global at the uh, Brentwood Centre for the MTK Show. Joined by Danny Dignam. Much more entertaining than your last fight, Danny. Yes, definitely, definitely. Good eight rounds in the bank. Um, he was a tough, very tough man. Uh, he was tricky. He didn't leave no openings or anything like that. So I like to be switched on in there because he was quite strong as well. Mm -hmm. And um, But no, it was a good learning fight. Very good learning fight. Definitely. Up till now, really, you've found it pretty comfortable. I know your last fight was a replacement opponent, so it was yeah, really awkward. You yeah, couldn't really yeah. get anything off, etc. Yeah. But uh, he bought it tonight. And, uh, yeah, he did, yeah. Yeah, and I think, personally, just sitting there watching it ringside, first couple of rounds, uh, it was nip and tuck, really. Yeah, and, was, then, yeah, and then yeah, I think yeah. you settled into it. Range a bit yeah, more. exactly, yeah, yeah. exactly. I mean, I, I didn't want to go out all guns blazing because it's the first time I, <coughs> I, I'm doing eight rounds. So um, I knew I had to go out there and take my time Listen, he's an experienced fighter. You can't go out all guns blazing. He's gonna catch you. So um, first few rounds, worked my way into it, and I sort of, I think I found my range towards the end of the fight. Mm. Is it pleasing though that you were able to adapt and box nicely towards the end? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I mean, to be a good boxer, you need to, you need to be a good thinker as well. So if you can change your game plan up in there as well, listen to care and listen to everyone else, and if you can actually do that, then yeah, it's good. It's, it's all learning. I think it was perfect timing as well to have that sort of fight where you did have to switch on and think. Yeah, I had to dig deep. I had to dig, dig deep in there because um, he was a dangerous man. I had to be switched on for eight rounds. And uh, that was a good fight. A very good fight. I guess from here it can only go up in terms of level now. Yeah, I mean, I want a title now. So I'll um, leave it down to Lee and the team, MTK and that, and um, see what they can deliver. I mm -hmm. mean, they've done a good job of me so far. And um, I trust them fully. What, what, what MTK are doing... I have my full trust in them. Um, I'm not sure if you're aware, obviously, there was the Ultimate Boxer Middleweight Tournament last yeah. night. Um, I'm guessing you haven't seen any of the fights. How do you think you'd have fared with them sort of opponents in there last night? Though? I did watch some of it. Okay. I, watched, I watched bits of it, yeah. Um, I wasn't really... No, nah, without being disrespectful, I mean, I was, no one really stood out for me. I mean, I like um, young Sean Phillips, good fighter. He's going to learn a lot from... Um, from that, um, I don't know. I, I, know I might sound big headed here, but I feel like I'm above that level at the minute. So, um, no disrespect to any of them because there is some good fighters in there, without a doubt. There's some good fighters in there, but I believe I'm just a little bit above that level at the minute. So, um, but you could have been easily been in that tournament to be fair. Yeah, I probably, could, it, I probably could have. Yeah, to go but we were thinking about titles, not really a free free mm. competition. So, I mean, it is a good competition to win. And uh, Derek Jose, he won, he won it, yeah, so fair play to yeah. him, yeah. It was, a, it was a very good achievement for him, but we've got our, our sights set on other things, so that's our route, you know. Yeah, sure. Um, Kevin, just a word from yeah. yourself uh, tonight on Danny. Yeah, um, I thought it was a good performance, really. Done a few things wrong. Um, got caught with a big shot and he recovered quite well. Um, just, he was a dangerous opponent, do you know what I mean? He's, he's fought for the European title mm. four or seven times. Fought for the world title, only been stopped three times by, you know, Kilbrook, Kilbrook yeah. and, and a world, world champion. So we knew we weren't going to get him out of We were prepared for a long, hard fight, do you know mm. what I mean? And uh, that's what he got. Um, it, like I said, there's a few mistakes he made in there, but that's why we just keep learning, do you know what I mean? Keep learning, and hopefully we get a title shot in the next fight or two. I do just want to ask um, someone within the corner what their sort of view was. When the opponent, I speak to Charles. You like we, we, when the opponent sort of, yeah. What what was going on there? Oh, I didn't see what. Uh, what when he came over? Oh, yeah, yeah. I thought he was doing it right. He's back. He was trying to play true. He was trying to guide it, like yeah, get, yeah. get you in and then tear you up. He, he was. Yeah, he was, yeah, he was a bit of a joke. While we're trying to pull his leg. So basically, what happened is, I caught him with a good shot. I remember it. I, I caught him with a good shot. Kev went, yes, yeah, Dan, that's it. He turned around, looked at Kev to try and act, like be a bit smart, a bit clever. I looked at him. <laughs> so as he looked at him, I thought, chin him. <laughs> so I ran in and, and tried to chin him, but I think I tried too hard. I didn't, I didn't land it right. Listen, so I wish I caught him and knocked him out. That was it. <laughs> because I didn't do nothing wrong. You should not. You've got to protect yourself all the time. So mm. You can't turn your back and look at me, corner man. It's cheeky as What's well, it? isn't it? Classic Mayweather Ortiz moment, there. wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, he's very clever. I mean, he's I did connect all, all, the, all, all the kidding, all, all the like winking and looking away and all that. And them shots hurt you. Don't worry about that. I don't care who you are in the ring. Do you know what I mean? You keep getting it with jabs like you keep getting it out of the body. You keep, it, it hurts anyone. And, and eventually it's going to break down. Do you know what I mean? But he's very good at kidding you. Do you know what I mean? And making you think he's not hurt. 
He's a very experienced fighter, mm. isn't he, you know? And he's a big punter as well, do you know what I mean? He's, he, but he was just looking for that one shot when he all the time, that, that right hand, yeah. and, we, and we sort of see it, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's got to keep the rage. Well, listen, we trained hard for this. We, we trained hard for this and, and got a result. That's the Job done. Last week or two that's out, that. Huh? You know what I mean? But that's my thanks sixth for Charles, fight. Thanks to Charles, he's running yeah, over there. We've all been out. We've been out of my bar. He's not... He's not... He hasn't even felt the, the eighth round. Have you, Dan? No. And hopefully, that's it. Hopefully, it's a title next... MTK have promised him a title fight. Next fight, mm -hmm. too. So, hopefully, I think they'll deliver. That was my sixth fight in about ten months, so... Eleven months, that was my sixth fight, so... Wow. I'm going to have a nice like, week or two break <laughs> and then just get back to it. Kevin to just up. said no. <laughs> <laughs> what did I tell you about going down the middle way though? Mm. You did tell me that, actually, yeah. 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 And look how he's performing mm. there. Just shows you. Danny, well done tonight. Kevin, appreciate your time. You. Cheers, boys. I'll pan it around. Thank well done on the win and oh. Sponsors? Yes, you know that, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> it's got about 300. I time. almost forgot. I don't even know how I forgot. How much you got on your card? <laughs> I, cannot, I can yeah. never, ever forget my sponsors because it weren't for them. I won't be boxing, so... Get them all. Make right, sure you got get everyone, every one of them in. What's he promised? A percent of his sponsorship. Sam <laughs> Cameron, then. Yeah, add on the back. What percent are we talking? I've got to leave it now. Danny's quite generous. <laughs> right, that's all done. Nice one, Danny. Thank you to every one of my spo um, sponsors and to everyone who come out to support me as well. Can't do it. Like Give him his cut. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, boys. Well done. Thank you. Thank you.